Honorable Speaker, thank you. I'm sorry to interrupt the chair of the NGCDF committee who is doing a very good job. But Honorable Speaker, when I look around the house, I do not see the members for Samburu East, and I also do not see the member for Kandara constituency. And Honorable Speaker, from the 11th and 12th Parliament, at least the two houses have been, it has been a tradition that when we are approving these names of uh, constituency CDF committee members, the member of the particular constituency be in the house before we approve the names that relate to their constituency, because they are the ones who are involved in the public participation and the approval process right at the sub-county level of these names. Uh, therefore, request Honorable Speaker that we drop this particular motion until such a time that the two members will be present in the House. And also, Honorable Speaker, because we cannot be slaving for people to pass their names and they are not even in the House. And you know, we are all sent here by the people of our constituencies to represent them. Therefore, if the member for Kikuyu is not in the House, the business of the people of Kikuyu should pause until the member of Kikuyu comes back. Therefore, I wish, I wish to request you, Honorable Speaker, to uh, indulge me and we drop this motion until such a time that the two members shall be in the House. And if you notice, Honorable Speaker, the member for Samburu East is actually a replacement. Therefore, it would be dangerous uh, to even be replacing a member when the member is not there to appraise the house of why there is a replacement. The member for Kandara to tell us whether these are the people who are actually elected and nominated at the sub-county level and therefore beg that we drop this particular motion until such a time when the two members are in the house. And it also encourages members, Honorable Speaker, to be present in the business of the house. If we get into the custom of approving things that relate to a member and the member is not in the house, then no member has any business being in the house. And like uh, Professor Nikal, who is always in the house, or uh, the member for Homabe constituency, or the Honorable Udo and uh, Honorable Agnes Pareyo, who are always in the house, uh, and the member for Kajiado Central, and of course the member for Kikuyu and the member for... Uh, <laughs> And member for Thika and uh, member for the Honorable Tandaza and the member for uh, county member for Busia. Honorable Speaker, because it is good, you know, when you are here, Honorable Speaker, you are also being accountable to your constituents. And when you are serving in a risky position like mine, it is also good to be seen, to be here, uh, and to be heard. You know, Honorable Speaker, on Tuesday, I was here the whole day up to the time the house rose in the evening. Uh, and Honorable Speaker, I have this afternoon seen uh, Mr. Raila Odinga purporting that I was in a meeting somewhere with the Deputy President and the member for Kiharu. And you know, it, it is allowed to have hallucinations at um, some age, Honorable Speaker, uh, but please don't hallucinate with me. And I want to request the former Prime Minister, as much as he may have hallucinations, please don't hallucinate with me. I was in the house up to the time the house rose, when I went home, my three-year-old daughter, who sleeps late like me, Honorable Speaker, we slept around the same time. Actually, I dozed off uh, holding on to my three-year-old daughter, <laughs> Honorable Speaker. And I will send, the, I will send Mr. Odinga and the people who, he was with at that press conference to my three-year-old daughter to just inform him where I was on that particular Tuesday Majority and leader. seize the hallucinations. Honorable members, there are so many points of order, but there is a very important matter that has been raised by the majority uh, leader on this subject. Well, um, the Honorable Nikal on my left and... Thank, thank you, Mr. Speaker, uh, Madam Speaker. First of all, my point of order is... What is out of order, first of all? What Honorable out of Nikal. order, Madam Speaker is mentioning pe people's names who are not in the house and in a negative way and yes